Monday night, a man was arrested in connection with that deadly hit and run in Luzerne County. Eyewitness News reporter Julie Dunphy spoke to the family of the victim for the first time since the arrest. 30-year-old Kevin Dendulk of Montgomery County was tragically killed early Saturday morning. The highway worker was in a closed-off lane on I-81 in Hazel Township, marking pavement when he was hit by a car and left for dead. The Dendolk family initially spoke to us Monday afternoon, pleading for the driver to turn themselves in. Monday night, police arrested 27-year-old Zachary Garbino of Sugarloaf Township. I'm sorry to the family. My deepest condolences. I'm sorry. The Dendolk family releasing this statement Wednesday, thanking the public for their help, stating, quote, the Dendolk family would like to thank the police for doing such an outstanding job and all of those who participated in this process. Garbino is charged with accidents involving death or personal injury and tampering with evidence. The grieving family can breathe a sigh of relief now that Garbino is behind bars. The statement they issued to Eyewitness News goes on to read, We are very thankful for the outpouring of love and support given by so many during this horrific time and wish to thank everyone for their many prayers. Court documents say investigators were able to track down Garbino and he was repairing the gray Hyundai accent involved in the hit and run, which actually belonged to his grandmother. The Dandolk family is now asking for their privacy, saying this loss is completely devastating and we ask for privacy to be able to mourn our son and only brother. Julie Dunphy, Eyewitness News. Gerbino was denied bail. His preliminary hearing is scheduled for August 17th.